In this lesson of video number 19 of Learn Hindi the Easy Way with J, we are going to see the combination of up and ho. As a learner, you'll often encounter up ho instead of up he in the day to day conversation. So it's a spoken form, and let us understand that better. As you already know, tum and ho and up and he, they are the theoretically right combination. Tum is a term we use for familiar people and up is a term we use in formal situation. In a very conversational Hindi, just imagine you wish to be respectful and at the same time add a familiar or endearing tone in your speech. In such a case, it is okay to use up ho instead of up he. So it is up ho. And you might be knowing he and ho is verb hona that is conjugated. If you like this kind of comprehensive elaborate learning system, you can check my other videos which I have uploaded under this channel. You can also write your comments below so it can be a participatory learning. Now let us see an example. Just imagine you want to ask that elderly person there, Aap ke se ho? That is how are you? Aap ke se ho is fine to say instead of Aap ke se hai. Because you know, know him quite well and it is just not that you need to know a person. Nowadays it's becoming more very common to use Aap ho. So it is can say up case ho and then you want to ask him are you on holidays then you can use the chutti me ho chutti me ho that is and because you have already used up once you don't have to keep repeating up then it becomes redundant you don't have to say up case ho up chutti me ho no you can just say up case ho then chutti me ho because you have already used up I hope that is clear now. The next example is just imagine that person, the man there is asking to that lady, are you on leave today? And what are you reading now? Maybe he's inquiring about a book or something that she's reading now. And aaj chutti mein ho. So aaj, that is today, chutti mein ho. You can give up on aap. And then the, the next phrase, he's asking, aap kya padti ho? So you'll often see that if it, if you're going to be dropping that up or them continuously, it leads to confusion. So people, if you want to be respectful and still use the whole form, every once in a while you keep introducing that up just to make sure you're using the combination of up and ho and not tum ho. So here you can understand from the two phrases. He's asking, aaj chutti mein ho, aap kya padti ho? So you're on leave today and what are you reading? Aaj chutti mein ho, aap kya padti ho? And because it's a lady he's talking to, is padti ho, not padte, instead it's padti ho. Aap kya padti ho? The next phrase is, aap pehle ye kaam karo. Just imagine the girl is talking to the another girl there or to the man there in both the cases. But from this phrase, you cannot make out if it's if you're talking to a man or a woman. But all that you can understand is the, the combination of up and ho is used. How is that? There's no ho, but instead karo. Up karo. That is you do. But theoretically, it has to be up. Kariye, aap kariye. You can check on my earlier video. Aap kijiye or aap kariye should have been the proper one, but in the conversational Hindi, it becomes aap karo. Aap pehle ye kam karo. You first do this. You first do this job. Let us see another two examples now. The first one is you are talking to that man and the next one is you are talking to that woman. The first one is Aap kab aoge? So Aap kab aoge? And the next one is Aap bike se office jati ho? You are going to office by bike? The first case 
it is future tense and you're using the combination of up and aoge and in the second case you're using up and again jati ho it has to be theoretically jati hai but because as i've explained the combination of up and ho it is jati ho and because it's a girl lady it is jati ho not jate ho aap bike se office jate ho you're going to office by bike in the first case you're talking to a man and so aap kab aoge when will you come aap kab aoge when will you come the second one is aap bike se office jate ho you're going to office by bike i hope you enjoy this detailed and very well explained videos it can be very useful for a learner to avoid embarrassing mistake and to pick up the language quite faster and i've just started this channel and depending on the number of takers and how much you like this type of learning i'll upload more and more videos accordingly all the best with your hindi learning